Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to Ram Overload. Today I'm going to be talking about how to easily make your internet slightly faster with this one tool. Okay, so it's called 1.1.1. It's basically a DNS by Cloudflare. And I don't know if you guys heard of it, but if you haven't, you definitely should know more about it. It provides some great features and uh, definitely speeds up the your internet. You know, it, for some people it's more than others, right? Um, so you definitely should try this out before anything. So let's go to my speed test, right? Let me just refresh and let's run it and see what my speed is locally. Okay, so it's around 190. Oh, it reached 200. Ping is 14 milliseconds. And then let's see what the upload speed is. So I ran this a couple of times before also. So it is roughly this number, you know, just slightly above or below. And the upload is upload goes up to you know closer to 200 sometimes. Okay, yeah. So right there, ping. You can see 14 is still 14, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So ping 14 milliseconds, download 193.14, and the upload is 195.09. Okay, so now we want to get this. So it's available for Windows or Mac or Linux, whichever operating system you you're using. Right, I have Windows, I already installed it, so you just click Windows and it's gonna download a tool, which I won't do it because I already, uh, I already um, installed it. Right, and then over here on your tray icons over here, the hidden ones, you'll see this cloud. Okay, it'll be grayed out and once you click it, you should be able to enable it. All right, so now you can see there's 1.1.1.1.1. Okay, so one thing you want to do is go to the settings and make sure you have the top one selected and not with warp. So the one with warp is a lot slower, but it does offer more protection in terms of privacy. So your internet is not private, whatever. So we're going to just be using this one, right? Um, this one is just as good, but warp um, allows for more um, protection. But um, it, I noticed that it does um, provide slower internet speeds as well. So let's first try with this. So, all right, that's all you need to do. You're connected, your DNS queries are private and faster. All right, so let's save this, right? Um, I'll just take a little snippet. So I, I got it right here, so don't worry about that. I'll just save it over there and let's refresh the. So we're gonna run it once again and see what the speed is. So let's do it. We can see ping 12, which is already um, better than our previous 14, right? And the internet speed, it's 175, 176, one, or closer to 180. This one is slightly lower than our previous 190. And the upload speed is, let's see, 170 is climbing, it's climbing. Around 190, oh, it reached, okay. 203, 205. So you guys can see over here, let's bring up our previous ones. The ping is a lot better. Our internet speed, the download speed did get a little worse and our upload speed is um, quite a bit better. All right, um, so you know, it really depends on if you run this tool again, uh, you probably will see a different result. This might be below or higher and this might be lower or higher. So it's just kind of, you kind of have to run it a couple of times to get like an average. Right, but overall, this you have seen there are some improvements, uh, whether it be on the download, the pings, or the upload, right? Um, yeah, so that, and not only this, um, you do have now a faster, um, I guess, you, you do have not only like a faster DNS that you're connecting to, but you also have a more secure and private DNS that you're uh, going through, all right? So all your connections or internet is going through that secure and private um, DNS okay you can try with warp also let's just try that as well I believe okay they don't have warp plus all right so now let's test it again one more time I know this is going to be slower because I have tested it in the past and it is known to be slower than uh, other ones where you're just going straight from um, not using warp just straight to the 1.1.1 .1 .1, um, DNS 
So you can see over here, Cloudflare Warp, that's what it's connecting to. It's not connected to my um, provider anymore, right? But you guys can see that it's a lot slower uh, compared to what it was before, almost like 100 megabytes slower. All right, and let's see the uploads. I'm sure that's going to be a lot slower as well. Uh, upload's not too bad. Download is definitely a lot worse, but upload, it's it's still fairly pretty good in my opinion. All right. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, that's pretty much it for today's video. You definitely want to download this tool. Definitely check it out. Um, it's really good for your internet, you know, just more, more security um, and privacy, which, you know, I believe nowadays everyone could have more of, especially on the internet. But yeah, let me know what you guys thought. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Peace.